Hello everyone, my name is Alfonso Bravo, Academic Internship Specialist here at the Birmingham Community College. Today I want to talk to you about our upcoming Internship Expo that is happening on January 14th from 1 to 3 in the afternoon. Let's get into some frequently asked questions. Hopefully from these questions you'll be able to leave this video having a better understanding of what's going to happen that day and how you could prepare yourself. Question number one, what is an Internship Expo? This is a great, great question. An Internship Expo gives you an opportunity to control your job search strategy and have the opportunity to talk to a recruiter. It's a great opportunity not only for students, but also for alumni, recent graduates that do not have extensive work history and they want to talk to a recruiter and give them a sense of what they are all about. You want to talk to them and share what you have done, maybe share some highlights, even if it's just schoolwork. Don't worry, talk about that. You know, what What do you do in your classes? Learn how to use certain programs, your portfolios, etc., etc. You also want to share club activities where you guys involved in any clubs? What do you do? Were you a member, part of the e-board? Disclose that information. Last but not least, if you are somebody that has volunteered, write that down. Make sure you disclose that day of the expo. Recruiters will be able to understand from the work that you have done from school and those activities that you may be someone that they are looking for. This is also a great way to skip a couple steps. You look for opportunities on different platforms, Indeed, Internships.com, Career Express. From there, once you apply, you're just waiting to hear back from them. At the Internship Expo, you're skipping those steps. You have the opportunity to talk directly with that employer, with that recruiter that's interviewing for those particular openings. Question number two, how does the whole process work? If you scroll down, boom, boom, scroll a couple times, you're going to be able to see a list of employers that will be attending the fair. Your job now is to look at those companies that are going to be participating, do your research, look at the positions that they have available, make a list of the companies that you are interested in and put them in, in priority. List the top three, maybe the top five, and then from there, you want to start working on your elevator pitch, which leads our question number three. What is an elevator pitch? Which is also a great question. At the Internship Expo, you have a very, very short time frame to talk to a recruiter, to talk to the employer. The idea behind the elevator pitch is that, let's say you were to enter an elevator and you were to share a ride, let's say five to six floors with somebody influential, will you be able to make a good impression on um, in those 30 to 45 seconds that you are with them. At prior events, you know, most of the conversations were very brief, maybe anywhere from two to four minutes. At this particular expo, you're going to have the opportunity to talk to a recruiter anywhere between five to 10 minutes. It's a little bit more time. However, you still want to make a first grade impression, right? You want to make sure that you have the opportunity to go over everything there is that you bring to the table and leave there solid, knowing that you did your best, making sure that the employer is excited that they were impressed with the information that you disclosed. All right, so now you are probably still asking yourself, okay, so what is an elevator pitch, right? You didn't really answer the question. So an elevator pitch is a brief overview of your professional and educational accomplishments and information relevant to your skills and your career goal. You guys, hopefully, you've taken the time to do the research. You have a good understanding of what the company is looking for. So with that information in mind, you want to make sure your elevator pitch steers in the direction of those positions. You know, you're targeting those companies. Most candidates, you know, once again, they have very general pitches. You know, now that you have targeted companies, what I recommend is throwing some additional information, throwing some spices in there, you know, spice it up, spice up your pitches, customize them. That way you let them know that you are really, really interested in working with them. I provided some links on the side that could help you prepare and practice your elevator pitch. So make sure guys, make sure that you practice your pitch several times before attending the expo. So how do I actually meet the recruiter? It's virtual. What's going to happen? What can I expect? The fair is actually virtual. So once you are registered for the internship expo via Career Express, you'll have the opportunity to upload your resume. The day of the event, go on Career Express. You'll be able to see the companies that are attending. You'll be able to click on the company that you're interested in and you'll be added to the queue. This means that you're basically being added to the virtual waiting line and waiting for the recruiter to become available. Once the recruiter becomes available, they will click on your name and you'll be admitted to their virtual room. You'll have the opportunity to chat with the employer and then take it from there. What should you wear? Another, another great question. So most job fairs, the expectation is for you to wear a suit. You want to put yourself in a business state of mind. If you don't have a suit, then just do your best to create a business casual sort of outfit. On the side, I provided some links that give you a better idea of what 
what business casual looks like if you don't have a suit at the moment. The week of the internship expo, we will have internship prep sessions. They are going to be posted on Career Express. Actually, if you go on Career Express now, you'll be able to see the prep sessions. What you could do, go to events, click on workshops, and you'll be able to see the four sessions that we are providing on both Monday and Tuesday. So Monday, we have two sessions. Tuesday, we have two other sessions. Great opportunity for you to meet with career coaches that can answer individual questions that you might have about the internship expo and also a great opportunity for you guys to come in and practice your elevator pitch that's basically all i have for you today i hope that you guys were interested in hearing what i had to say and i hope to see all of you that watch this video at our upcoming internship expo thank you guys